Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be doing a reading on Jenny from the K-pop girl group Blackpink and G Dragon. And I'm just gonna be looking into their relationship and see was their dating rumor true. So let's get started. We're just gonna be seeing like is it true? Okay. Okay, so the first two cards that came out was the Ice Queen and the Gossip. So, it seems that Jenny don't really have any interest in G-Dragon like that. It's kind of like she's kind of cold to him, or she's just not paying attention to him, honestly. Not even cold, it's just like, you know, just like, oh, kind of like... She don't have time for him, that type of thing. And I feel like this rumor was just to get people to talk, just to get people to talking and, you know, gossip, just to get people talking about it. But really, she don't have no interest in him like that. That's what I'm getting. Okay. We got the money and the work card. So this seemed to just be something that was supposed to come out maybe due to money and work, maybe to get just people talking you know, get them, you know, just being like, yes, they're dating. Because, you know, they are big role models in the industry. A lot of people know who G-Dragon is. And a lot of people know, of course, who Jenny is. So, it seemed just to be something that's just to get people talking type of thing. It's something related to money and work. Maybe they got paid to do this type of thing. Maybe it was like an incident where um, they were like, came, somebody came to them and was like, hey, you know... Could y'all come out and say this? Could y'all come out and do that uh, type of thing? And we may pay y'all or something. Or it could help y'all career type of thing. But I'm saying she don't really have any interest in him like that. Okay, so let's pull some of these romance cards to kind of see. Okay, so the cards that came out was the flirt in reverse, the honeymoon, free yourself, and attraction. So there may be some attraction maybe from G Dragon shot side. I don't know why. <laughs> there may be some attraction from G Dragon side type of thing. But on Jenny's She's not really stunning him. Like I said, she doesn't really flirt with him like that. But there could be some attraction from, like I said, from G, G Dragon's side. But honestly, I'm not seeing love. And these are love cards. And not a single real love one came out. But I see they may really work together and may be, like, cool with each other. But in a romance aspect, not really. It's like with the honeymoon card, it's like they probably do enjoy spending time together, hanging out, maybe making music on a work-based level type of thing. Okay, let's pull some more. Let's pull some tarot for time to see. Okay. So the cards that came out was the Nine of Swords in Reverse. The Eight of Pentacles, again, working hard, work-based pentacles, Ten of Swords in reverse, Ace of Cups, and the Moon. So with this relationship, this, um, or this bonding that they have, it's still not any love in there. It's just, like, work. And it's just, like... Even with the Ace of Cups in reverse, it's like blocked emotions. There's nothing romantic there because if it was upright, then it would be love, new love, representing love. But, up, but in reverse, it's like there's no love actually there. I don't actually get the vibe that they love each other. They may love each other as friends. It's possible, but it's not anything romantic because with the Ice Queen, Jenny don't have no interest in him like that. Like she's not giving him the time of day type of thing. And then we got the other cards. It's like, this is something that they're going to learn from. 
this is going to be like a learning lesson from them and they're going to overcome this but with the moon it could be secrets it represents secrets like there's more to it that they're not coming out with which means it's yeah it's more secrets being withheld that many of people don't know but it worked if they wanted people to gossip about it it worked definitely they were trending for a while when it came to their relationship so it worked when it came to getting attention and gossip when it came to getting attention and gossip it worked but it probably did play an impact on some of them, but they kind of was kind of like maybe feeling some type of way, being like, oh, these people really is eating this stuff up. Yeah, but it's more to it with the moon. Like, there's more behind it. I'm just, it's just not love. It's more like, okay, more like a work base. Like, a lot of these, we got the pentacles coming up. And then again, we got, um, the queen of pentacles good business and stuff like i said it's it's work relates like they're, they're really good when it comes to a good business sense i feel like they really do work good together as a team like they probably do really do like you know meet up to work on stuff meet up to talk about work but if you're talking about love jenny definitely isn't interested with the ice queen she's like i'm not even looking his way so yeah, it just seemed like it was just something to get people to gossip and talk about. And it may have been money, and it's definitely work-related, but it may have been some money involved type of thing. So that's what I'm getting for D-Dragon and Jenny's reading. Please take with a grain of salt. Don't get into your feelings in the comments. I mean, you could share your opinion, but, like, be respectful at all times because if you don't, I will have to delete you off of my page because I want positivity on this page. So thank you for tuning in to my video. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. You can always request in the comment section down below. And tune into my next video. Bye.